Hello, this is Jonathan Landeros with Kadeev Technologies. And in today's video, I'm going to share a couple of tips on how you can organize your material library to make it a little more user friendly for your own application. So here we go into Showcase. And the first thing I'm going to do is go to my Appearance pull down and activate my material library. And here you can see the materials in our scene. And then here we have all the different materials we currently have available to us. And there's a lot we can choose from, which is great. We have a ton of choices. But the downside is you've got to filter through all those choices. So the first way you can narrow that down is to use the filter I'm indicating with my cursor right here. For example, I can type in blue. Showcase will filter down to all the materials that contain the word blue. Another example is I can filter for red. Now it'll go ahead and look up all the materials that contain red. It'll even find textured, which does contain the word red, R-E-D, in it. But this is a way you can filter that down. Now there's another option you have. If you have a material you're going to use all the time, even if you're not going to change it from the standard, you can right-click on it here, save to the library, and put it into your own materials. That will put it into its own category that I'm indicating right here. And you can add as many as you want there. Even if you don't modify them, you can go ahead and just grab them from this category. So if you have a few go-to materials you use all the time, they'll be there in one single location, as opposed to filtering through. So there you go. Just a couple of really quick tips on how to make your interface a little more friendly for the application that you use it for. That's it for this tip. Have a great day, everybody.